This short video will show you how to view triggered events for items in Sitka's Evergreen. Sitka's Evergreen can email pre-due, overdue, patron welcome and expiry notices, as well as emailing or texting hold ready for pickup notices, depending on the patron's choice. These notices are generated by action trigger events. An event is created when circulation or hold records meet the conditions set up for the notice. For example, when a new patron account is created. When the event is processed, a notice may be generated and passed to the email server to be delivered to patrons. Triggered events are viewable on the staff client via patron or item records. You can check the triggered events to determine whether notices have been generated for a particular patron or item. To view triggered events for an item, you must open the item status interface. Uh, you can click on the item status button on your toolbar, or you can use keyboard shortcut F5, or you can find it in the circulation or cataloging menu under circulation, show item status by barcode, or cataloging, display item. Scan or enter the item barcode and then hit submit. You'll want to highlight the item in the road data and click on actions for selected items and select show triggered events. By default, events with complete status for pre-due and overdue notices are displayed. You can use the filter on the right hand side to view hold notification events. Click the arrow beside circulation and choose hold in the drop down menu and then click on apply. To view events with any status, you may remove the event state filter by clicking the red X beside it. Now let's discuss event status. Complete status means that the event has been successfully processed. Usually this means the notice has been generated unless the notice generation process encounters an error, which is very rare. Events with status of invalid or error have encountered problems during the process. No notices were generated for such events. Pending and some statuses other than complete, error, or invalid may last for a short period of time while the event is being processed. If an event shows with the status complete but the patron has not received the email, it generally means that the patron needs to check their junk mail folder or that their mail server has not delivered the email for some reason. You may reset events with complete status to generate a new notice by selecting the checkbox in front of the event and then clicking on Reset Selected Events. You may cancel events with pending status to stop the notice generation by selecting the event and then clicking cancel selected events. Thank you for watching this video and for more information please visit the BC Libraries Cooperative website.